Hi and welcome to a new video. Have you tried to register a new Apple ID on your iPhone but encountered an error message stating that your device has been used to create too many Apple IDs? In this video, I will explain about this error and recommend a few alternatives to fix it. Let's go. Basically, this error message indicates that you have surpassed the limit of Apple IDs that can be registered on a single Apple device. Each Apple device is limited to creating up to three new accounts only within a year. Unfortunately, this restriction is validated by the iOS hardware, so even if you do a factory reset, it won't resolve this issue. At this point, the only way to add a new Apple ID is to create one on another Apple device, like an iPhone from a friend, your iPad, or your Mac. Another option is to create the Apple ID via browser on other devices, such as a Windows PC. However, keep in mind that Apple IDs with the iCloud domain is only available on Apple devices. If you're going to use a spare iPhone or an iPad, open Settings and press the Sign In banner at the top. You may need to sign out of iCloud first to see the Sign In button. Tap on Don't have an Apple ID or forgot it. Select Create Apple ID from the pop-up menu and then follow the on-screen instructions to complete the sign-up process. On a browser, on the other hand, visit iCloud.com and then click Create Apple ID from the login page. Next, complete the form by providing your personal information such as your name, region, and birth date. By default, the new Apple ID is mainly created as an iCloud account. But since I'm currently using a Windows PC, I am restricted to creating an Apple ID using alternative email domains, such as Gmail, Yahoo, and many others. After providing your Apple ID and password, choose your country code and assign a valid phone number. This will be used later to validate your registration. Type in the CAPTCHA code and click Continue to proceed. The following step involves the verification of your email address and phone number. Make sure to log in to your registered email, copy the verification code sent to you by Apple, and then paste it in the provided field. Apple will then send you another code to your phone number. Type it in to finish setting up your Apple ID. Finally, agree to iCloud Terms and Conditions. And just like that, you have successfully created your new Apple ID. Unfortunately, if you can still create a new Apple ID on any of these devices, reach out to Apple support and refer your concern. Most definitely, they can provide you with solutions and assist you directly in creating your account. And that's it. If I could help you, feel free to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Leave a comment down below if you have any questions. See you next time. Bye.